what's up? My name is TechNumber here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll be talking about how to fix a rather annoying issue with CurseForge and Windows 11 or preview slash insider versions of Windows. Essentially, insider versions of Windows are just Windows with newer features and a lot of things being tested out. However, some programs seem to have an issue with it, and one of them is CurseForge over here showing me this error. You are running a Windows Insider program version of Windows, which is not supported by Overwolf. Essentially, screw you, you're going to downgrade your entire operating system because I say so. This is absolute nonsense, and there's zero reason you need to do this. There is at least a workaround for this, even though it's not mentioned anywhere here. Of course, this happens when you're trying to install it, maybe when you're launching it as well, but this is the workaround for installing it at least. Hold start and press R to bring up the run dialog box and inside of here type in percentage program data percentage and hit enter. This will take us into C program data, a hidden folder. On Windows 11, you'll need to hit start, type in hidden and open show hidden files or a menu somewhat similar to that. It'll take us into settings, privacy and security for developers and under the file explorer section here, we need to make sure that show hidden and system files is ticked as well as show file extensions. When those are ticked, we can see what's inside of this folder here, or you may need to reopen it. Type in over and we'll be opening the overwolf folder here. Then setup and we'll see setupinfo.ini. Double click on this file here and you'll see a bunch of text. All we need to do is look for the current version, then add a new line and type in allow insider equals true with a capital T. Control S to save it. And if you see a pop-up like this, you'll need to save it onto your desktop, for example, first. Then we can drag it from our desktop back into the folder here to overwrite it, replace the file, continue. And there we go. It's now being edited to allow Insider. Now all we have to do is relaunch the setup. So reopening the Overwolf installer or whatever it is, this time you should see it gets past that warning screen. And it's open on the side over here, currently installing. It's incredibly unnecessary to have a warning like this. I do get that new versions of Windows can break the program in very confusing ways, causing headaches for developers if they choose to support it, so it's easier to choose not to support it. Instead of disallowing you to install it completely, I'd rather say that you don't provide support for insider builds of Windows 11. It's much more friendlier to users, and it especially allows them to use your plugin network and things like that without locking out an entire group of people. We're talking tens of thousands. Anyways, rent aside, it's now installed. CurseForge is working, so is Overwolf. So you can use whatever other plugins and add-ons and programs you downloaded with Overwolf as you would usually on Windows, but we're on Windows Insider. Anyways, that's really about it for this quick video. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.